Kia ora hui hui mai tātou katoa and welcome everybody. And our third finalist is David Cameron. David Cameron. David, motivated by his experience as a detention-prone student, is the founder and CEO of LearnCoach, providing learning support to secondary and tertiary students, inspiring them towards a better future. Since 2012, LearnCoach has grown from 150 students to over 150,000. These students watch over 1 million tutorials online each year, equivalent to filling a 300-seat lecture theatre 10 times every day, completely free. In 2016, David was named a future maker by Teach New Zealand for his achievement in engaging students with science and math study. In 2017, LearnCoach launched New Zealand's first ever second chance school, an instant pop-up school where any room can become an NZQA qualified classroom in, for example, a refugee centre, prison cell or hospital ward. It's one more step towards a world where any person at any time can have a second chance at education. Congratulations, David Cameron. David, education has changed obviously since you were a student and changed quite a bit since I was a student. <laughs> so, uh, my friend, how do you see education developing into the future? I, th I think it's the, the development that's happening which is really exciting about education at the moment. I mean, on the one hand, you've got all of these free courses online. You can learn from the best people in the world totally free. And then on the other hand, you've still got kids going to 100-year-old you know, classrooms learning 100-year-old material sometimes. So I think an upgrade is a, is a, is a good thing. And so, so you kind of run away with all the possible changes that could happen, but the, the maybe more interesting question is like what, what won't change? And I think things like deep personal relationships between teachers and students and students and their peers, things like engaging and, and challenging learning. And so the, the interesting thing though is that none of that's limited to the four walls of a classroom. And so it allows you to imagine kind of a future where yeah, anybody could come along, they could get, you know, choose their qualifications possibly through a smartphone, and, uh, and you're qualified from anywhere in the world. And so I think that is, uh, is a future that's really worth getting excited about. So, yeah. I Cheers. can tell you're excited yeah, yeah, about yeah, it already. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. Good to have you. We welcome Young New Zealander of the Year Award a warm round of applause for their achievements. And now to announce the University of Auckland Young New Zealander of the Year for 2018 is Vice-Chancellor Professor Stuart McCutcheon. And the winner of the University of Auckland Young New Zealander of the Year is David Cameron. That is a, is a, re a really nice surprise. Um, <clears throat> so that's a, it's a real boost for me personally, real boost for the, for the team, many of whom are here tonight, many of whom work tirelessly for free. Thanks, guys. <laughs> and, um, and, and, a, and a real boost in, in credibility, I hope, for, for going forward, which really means that we actually can reach you know, broader, deeper, richer experiences with, the, with the literally hundreds of thousands of students we'll interact with in the coming year. And so that's... that's Thanks very much. It means a lot. And thank you, Auckland University, for sponsoring it, for Kiwi Bank, also the, the judges, uh, the organisers, everybody. Because uh, it really does seem like you getting behind us like this is going to help rise the, the tide for all this generation of next young New Zealanders, I guess. Thanks very much. It means a lot. For the University of Auckland, Young New Zealander of the Year 2018, David Cameron. Please welcome to the stage the Prime Minister, the Right Honourable Jacinda Ardern.
Kia ora koutou katoa. Uh, and can I start by apologising that this late in the evening you have to listen to a politician uh, when you've been surrounded by so many amazing and inspirational New Zealanders. And I want to start by acknowledging um, every single finalist, but particularly every single category winner. David, thank you for educating our future.